A violent home invasion in Newport Beach turns deadly. A man takes out a rifle and opens fire on the two suspects who busted inside. Inside the home, two women and a child. Orange County reporter David Gonzalez is live in Newport Beach with what neighbors are saying about this deadly confrontation. David. Ellen and Colleen, neighbors and authorities are calling a crime like this one very rare. It all took place inside the gated community that you see behind me. You could tell that there's a 24 hour guard around the clock. So right now authorities are trying to figure out just how exactly these suspects were able to make it onto the property. But one thing we know for sure is that the suspects and the victims knew each other. Now, this is a really shocking crime. Newport Beach residents living in the Pelican Heights community of Newport Coast are shaken by a violent home invasion Tuesday morning. I heard and saw a very loud helicopter circled around and around and around our backyard for like an hour. Around 4.45 a.m., police officers were called out to a home on Vista Lucci about a possible home invasion. Investigators say two intruders got into the home through a side door. That's when they were confronted by a man inside the home who opened fire using a rifle. We know that there is a relationship uh, between the suspects, the two suspects, and the victims, the residents. Authorities found one of the suspects armed with a gun laying in the street suffering from multiple gunshot wounds. He was taken to a hospital and is expected to survive. A second suspect was spotted nearby in some bushes by an Orange County Sheriff's helicopter. Police tried to make contact and found that person dead from a self-inflicted gunshot wound. It was a targeted incident, so there are no threats to the community at this time that we're aware of. Two women and a child inside the home were not hurt. Newport Beach officials praised the homeowner for jumping into action to protect his loved ones. I can tell you right now, if you come into Newport Beach to commit a crime, we will defend ourselves, and today is an example of that. And we also asked the mayor and Newport Beach police if there was any connection to those South American burglary and theft rings that have targeted affluent neighborhoods just like this one. And they both said that those uh, types of situations are in no way related to what took place here. Police continue to investigate. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.